When it comes to the election process, security is of the utmost importance. Logic and accuracy testing takes place three times for every election and ensures that election coding and equipment are secure and accurate. The testing process begins with the appointment of a logic and accuracy testing board, which includes members from both the Republican and Democratic parties. Those board members then inspect every voting machine and scan to verify each machine is starting from zero, meaning it has been reset and only the data from that point forward will be recorded. After all machines are confirmed at zero, then our trained staff begins mock voting. This process ensures that every machine is functioning properly for every candidate and every contest in every precinct. For an election the size of November's general election, that means over 500 different ballot types are tested. Once a set of ballots is complete, the controlled results are loaded into our system and then reviewed by the bipartisan board we mentioned earlier. We complete a similar process with our mail ballot team to ensure the system accurately records the votes that come in via mail. The office must present 100% accuracy in reporting before it can continue down the road to early voting and election day.